So what we saw is PTR is pointing to address. Okay. So this is what we did is type casting. Okay, whatever I did here also is type casting. Okay. So I'll remove this now. Okay. Now let's say I'll make this variable a character variable. Okay. So what we know character is just it is one byte. Okay. Char is one byte in size. So and this is an integer. So integer pointer, which I mean, which tells compiler, okay, this points to an integer, is actually pointing to a character address. Okay. So now here I'm printing the address, and here I'm printing the data of that character. Okay. So I have typecasted. Okay, though it's not needed. It's already an integer pointer in itself. Let's see what we are getting. Oh, we are not getting 10, we are getting some other data. Okay. So, if you closely observe, what we are getting at the end is one byte, which is intended for us. But what this ended up reading, it read four bytes, because it's an integer pointer. Yeah. So, it read four bytes. So, now, uh, let's see, I mean, let's... Uh, let me demonstrate this that okay this is actually the last byte what you're reading yeah so this is actually the last byte 19 and if you clearly closely observe whatever address we have that is being read here but it's not that it's not the case that whenever we do this first we read the address and then the data no it's not that this address whatever is there this ptr okay this also has to have a location in the memory correct it also has a memory so this ptr is present right before our variable okay so that's why the address pointed by ptr is also there so it's reading 19 and then 3 bytes backwards okay so, uh, just to demonstrate this, how this memory arrangement is, okay. So, what I'll do, I'll add few more variables here. Um, care where one. I'm using 0x. This is uh, easy in understanding. Yeah. Care where to 0, 30. Care where 3, 0, 40. Okay, so what we saw is, uh, let's see how these memories are arranged. I mean, is this arranged first or this arranged first? So, I'll copy this. And I paste it. Yeah. This is pasted here. Variable 1, variable 2, variable 3. Let's get each other's address now first. Variable 3. Okay. So let's as of now forget this and let's see these first these statements. Now I can build it. Is there a build error? No. So if you see variable 3 is at the least address. Okay, 14, 15, 16, 17. So now, and then if I try to read this one, address of variable. So it's actually reading 17, 18, 19 and 20, 4 bytes from here. Okay, so this is at 17th location, 18, 19, 20. Okay, so what I'll do, I'll just print what's there, the address after this. Okay, 18. You can see this whole thing is present. Uh, 61FE18. Okay. 0x61FE18. And convert it to address. Sorry, pointer. Build it. either result okay so what i 
what I'm trying to tell here is start see here 61 fe17 okay so the address after this okay 14151617 at 18 we have this one stored okay so at 18 what we have at 18 we have the address of var address of var is 61fe17 so that's what we ended up printing okay now let let's see what it will print out if the moment i make it variable 3 here let's make this pointer point to variable 3 yeah and uh, here i'll still use ptr and uh, yeah so i expect all these four should be printed now yeah but this is what you are seeing first 40 30 20 18 so it's in this order it is printing though i am pointing ptr to variable 3 and this is happening because variable ptr is pointing to character it's a integer pointer it is pointing to character so that's the reason it's though it's printing 40 which is supposed to which is one byte but it also reads four more three more bytes okay so this is where it becomes very important for us to use similar type of pointers correct so here at the moment i change it to character pointer i think everything will will be correct i guess let's see if this can work um compile it see this is exactly what i told you i can now this is a character pointer pointing to a character so character pointer will read one byte so that's what it's doing it's only reading one byte 40 okay so this kind of uh, erroneous bugs can get injected when you define an integer pointer and make it point to a character variable which is of a lower size and here if you don't type cast it to char yeah you end up getting a error okay so this is also working but only thing i have to type cast it but just to avoid this i mean if you can make it a character pointer it's always better to change the pointer to a same type as it's pointing to 